This is Virgil Koopman. He doesn't know it yet, but he's about to be caught on camera shooting at a rival gang in Manaburg, Cape Town. Thanks to ShotSpotter, the latest gunshot detection system, CCTV cameras could capture Koopman as he committed the crime. After shots are fired, police and the city of Cape Town's law enforcement officials quickly arrive on the scene. Koopman then hands his gun over to another man and changes his clothes to avoid detection. As law enforcement officers are searching a nearby house for the gun, Koopman, now wearing a white jacket, is located thanks to CCTV. Eight months later, 21-year-old Koopman is convicted for firing a weapon in a residential area. Law enforcement officers said that without ShotSpotter, Koopman might not have been caught and convicted. So what is ShotSpotter and how does it work? ShotSpotter detects gunshots through sensors set up in an area. It rapidly triangulates the exact location of the gunshot. House number 12, complaint code 19 Alpha, 6 rounds have been fired. A message is immediately sent to the CCTV camera operator and to police officers on the ground. This enables quicker response times and improved use of CCTV cameras to locate suspects. ShotSpotter may not stop gang-related shootings, which led to 662 deaths in the Western Cape in 2016-17 but the police believe it is improving the fight against gun crime. Discharging the firearm in a built-up area is an offence and every such incident should be the opening of a criminal case. The more of those cases that we open, the better. And ShotSpotter now con creates compelling evidence a case has to be opened and that will in due course affect the amount of resources allocated to this area, especially on the investigative side. It costs the city 10 million rand every year to operate ShotSpotter and Manenberg and Hanover Park two gang-ridden areas notorious for gun violence. But after the successful conviction of Koopman, the city now plans to link ShotSpotter to drones operated by law enforcement officers to improve video surveillance of suspects.